it's fall time so that means it's woolly bear season Woo! you might have seen these little fuzzy guys walking around this time of year and that's because they're getting ready to hibernate Woolly bears start thinking about hibernation in late fall, especially when the temperatures start to drop. They're looking for places to settle down, like under leaves or in rocks and crevices, things like that. And this is really cool to survive in the winter. The woolly bears have an antifreeze protein that prevents ice crystals from forming in their bodies. This effectively lowers the freezing point of the liquid in their body. Woolly bears can survive to temperatures of negative 20 degrees Fahrenheit. That's, I think that's so crazy. Woolly bears are also known to be able to predict winter, though I don't know how accurate this is. If the woolly bear has a larger brown stripe, then it means there's going to be a more mild winter. And if it's more black, it's going to be a more severe winter. In all the woolly bears I found this fall, I, I got a variety of answers and predictors for what the winter's going to be like, so I won't make a guess. Woolly bears are so friendly and you don't need to be afraid of touching them. Just being gentle and letting them kind of crawl on your hand. If they don't want to be on your hand, they'll let you know and you can let them back on the ground. So go out, find some woolly bears, send them some love, and we'll see them again this spring as the Isabella tiger moth.